Sindri requires Mimir's help in unlocking travel to Svartalfheim. He waits for me in his study. Here we go. How do we unlock the realms? We'll just need something from back at the workshop. Follow me, and be sure to bring the head. Uh, yeah. So, where exactly is Tyr being held? He's imprisoned in a mine somewhere. That's all we know so far. Hmm. The realm is full of mines, you realize. You'll need help narrowing it down. Oh, you should talk to Durlin. Who's Durlin? He's a cousin of ours, sort of. Works for the city on safety issues. Should have access to all kinds of information on mines. And I know he's no friend of Odin. That's why your mother sought his help when she was trying to whip up a rebellion. Ready? A rebellion? Did you know about that? I did not. A rebel leader who knew Mom. Sounds like exactly what we need. I think you missed the ta-da. <laughs> well, never mind. I'll have this oiled up in no time. Meet you at the gateway outside. Rebel leader? Derlin? <laughs> if that ain't giving a hound a haircut. Huh? And you, you just remember things however they pop into your bean, don't you? I suppose you think Derlin's just counting the days until a couple of strays show up looking for trouble. What do you mean, Brock? Will he help us or not? Oh, never mind. It ain't old Brock's place to cast asparagations on my relations. This much bunger notwithstanding. Ignoring you. Fine. Go darken Derlin's door. See for yourself how it goes. Just be warned, he's not the friendly sort of dwarf folk you're used to. Hmm. He's cranky as all get out. And he talk funny, too. Sounds like a true study in contrast. <sighs> uh, let's talk once. I've always wanted to see your home realm. Svartalfheim sounds... unique. Svartalfheim? <laughs> Stupid Aesir name. We look like Dark Elves to you. Oh, right. You call the realm something else. Neither Valir, which is also the name of the capital city. Oh, and wow. where you should look for Durlin. Damn city so full of Odin fuckers nowadays. It ain't hardly somewhere a self-respecting dwarf would show his face. Harsh, but accurate. Need of a leer. Trying to keep my Marvel brain out of this. You hear that? We'll just need the Bifrost in the head. Brock, do the touching. Oh, this would be the part requiring my assistance, then. You said it. This device here has been crafted to your measurements. It'll help you get a better look at the problem with those Bifrost eyes of yours. So, uh, do I control this thing somehow, then? Oh, no, 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 no. This is just to hold you in place while we shine this light. In your eyes. Oh, oh, Cynthia, sodding bastard. <laughs> Open. Open now. I was really hoping not to use the eyelid clamps. Do it. <laughs> oh. That's it. That's it. Good. Now, release. Still unpleasant. Oh, that's our cue. Come on, hurry! I'm coming, I'm coming! Crossful goes, eggs, man! What was that for? You'll see <laughs> soon enough. I need to adjust. <gasps> there! That should do it. Holy shit. <sighs> see? No permanent damage. I'll show you permanent damage, you wee fuck! Gritos! Throw me at him! Horns first! <laughs> <laughs> Can't you take a joke, you old goat? <laughs> The Bifrost is broken. Now that we've reconfigured these gateways to use Yggdrasil seeds, you won't need a travel table or a Bifrost lamp anymore. But what about light? I also used it for light. Okay, good note. I'll figure something out, but first, come on, let me show you how it works. It's 
So now we can travel between realms just from the door. Okay. Aim your key at the rune for Svartalfheim on the right. Then concentrate. About, uh, Arvangar wetlands. While hovering over. Mystic Gateway. This should take you to the wetlands outside Nidavellir City. Just make your way to the town square and ask for Durlin at the tavern. You sure they'll know him at the tavern? Durlin's always been an inveterate inebriate. I suppose he might have completely changed, but in my experience, eh. Did you want to come with us? Oh, I might drop in, but the wetlands are moist. And the Grim are everywhere. Hostile, slimy, foul-smelling creatures. But good luck! Thanks. Wait, what? I said good luck! So... This'll take us there? Whoa! Do you feel that? What's that, lad? Anything. Everything. It's warm. Eyes of Odin. You fucking Whoa. pile of shit. One less feathery spy. We can probably use this boat. If I can just get it free. More boat rides. Okay. Hold on. Let me take a look around real quick. Careful, lad. Why are these things so fast? What the fuck? God damn it. Are you gonna stop coming? There we go. I see we're already off to a lively start. Petraeus, you dropped your guard. I got the boat free though. Hmm. We can head through these channels when you're ready. Alright, let me pick up the boat. Or I guess I will drag the boat. I still can't believe Mom led a whole rebellion here against Odin and never talked about it. The fact that it didn't go well might have come that notion. What your mother did before we met was her business. Did you ever ask? Eyes on the water. There are resources. What do we got? Rawhide. If you never asked mom about what she used to do, what did you talk about when you met? Hmm. Like, did you just say, Woman, guard the house. I will go to catch fish in the river. And then leave for five days? <laughs> no. Your mother was far better at fishing than I. Did you see that over there? No. That wheel is blocking the channel. I imagine if you can turn it, we should be able to get through. There we go. So these are wetlands, huh? Pretty accurate. It is a bog. The smell is making my eyes burn. You know what is a fair bit more potent than when I last visited, now that you mention it. Looks like the path continues on the other side of that geyser. Can't jump through the geyser is what I'm guessing. <laughs> if only we were in Midgard. That water'd be frozen in a second. Hey. <laughs> you make a good point. Thanks, kid. Hmm. 
Tyr was a friend to the Giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. If he was a part of the rebellion here. It's certainly possible. The God of War often advocated for the Giants. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. You know... I'm starting to hear... Rado's fucking moving around a ton like he's... He's getting those dad breaths. Just breathing hard for no reason. I mean, obviously he has a reason. He's fucking doing crazy shit. But I don't recall him doing that that much. Here we go. Tap L1 to the last second to parry an enemy of our stun. Okay, we got more. the other one. Oh, let me do this. Wait. Just let me... I wanted to jump off the ledge and fucking... One more to go! That's good enough. Gotta be some way to turn the wheel up here. Got our first real puzzle here. Well, oh shit! Give a man some warning if he's about to suddenly end up snout deep in cheek. The ground. Was that an earthquake? No. Hmm. An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Spartelfine. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Oh wow. Nice job getting it to lower exactly where we need it. Condescending. In a sense of like from a developer's thinking, point like, huh? Because it's so warm, maybe it's not that the cold hasn't made it here yet, but maybe it's just different in Sparto Farm? Aye lad, Fimble Winter doesn't strike all realms quite the same way. It's weird that Fimble Winter doesn't always make it winter. In Midgard it does, but as you can see, the effects here appear far more gaseous in nature. Observe the geysers. Observe the aforementioned aroma. These effects were present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to them. Ooh. And eat an apple, here we go. Okay. Alright, glad I fucking went back for it. Let's go. Think we can fit under that bridge? Hmm. Just barely. Wait a minute. Is that one of the tiers? Tier 
Tears of the World Tree. Yggdrasil's Dew of Runic Power. Okay, I got it off a little bit. Slag Deposits. Alright, I'm gonna need a stopping point here soon because I am fucking tired. Please fuck it. Got him. Okay, can we walk through this? No. Can't jump over there either. Can I climb this? No. Guess we're going up here. You hear that? He's even breathing while breathing heavy from walking. Father, there. Is Kratos getting old? What is that? More slag deposits. There's a lot of shit to loot out here. God damn. Find anything good up there? Some, yes. We gotta go to the other beach now. Just right over here. But the water does not reach. But the water does not reach. Hmm. Well, if we... Did you get up to a fucking point of view where I could see that thing? One of those 
There we go. Back to the boat. I'm just gonna not call the axe until. If the dwarves of this realm are anything like Rock and Sindri, it's hard to imagine them siding with Odin. Well, all too often people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offered them safety, and defying him can be quite dangerous. Maybe they just need a couple of gods to come along and take the fight to him. Atreus, that is not why we are here. I was only joking. War is not a joke, especially where gods are concerned. Oh, man. Shit is gonna get fucking real in this game. But I need a place to stop. It seems, Atreus, you intend to recruit Tyr as an ally for war. I just... I'm trying to keep our options open. Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here. Exploring a new realm. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warmth? Looks like we gotta find a way to open that gate if we want to get to neither of Yeah. It's too fast. Then how shall we catch it? Flank it. Attack from behind. Good. Where the hell is it? Gotta get behind it. But how? Well, it just. I don't know. Not too worried about it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you did it. Let's see what it draw. Okay, so those things got uh, quite a bit of shit on them, and that's all this was built for. Right on. Father, up there. Gotcha. All right, we'll find out what's wrong with doing this real quick. Oh, that's one part of the gate. Halfway there. There's got to be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. Look! There's a chain we can pull up there. Alright. Oh, fuck. Grim first up high! Knock him down! Cursed Grim? Capped. Think you can uncover that geyser from here? <laughs> All right. oh. hmm. oh. Damn it. Oh. oh, I think I get it. If you freeze the geyser, the pressure will turn the wheel. Uh, I gotta cut that thing. Well, no. Got it. Nice one. Almost missed it. Blocks coming down. Hmm? Can you see anything from that block? Not yet. That's one of Cavassier's poems. Very highbrow. 
You should collect any others you find. Why? There we go. Lad, if I may, what exactly are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well, like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? Hmm. Let's hope Tyr's in a talkative mood after being imprisoned for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. I'm really interested to see where this goes. If we really get Tyr in the very beginning. Oh, I don't know. I feel like he can't be that easy, but at the same time, we also fought Thor in the first fucking hour of the game, so. That earthquake earlier. You think there will be another one? <laughs> it's unlikely, but geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fimble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye, you might be onto something, lad. I don't think that was an earthquake. Atreus, look ahead. Wow, it's now a village? this looks like a city. Welcome to Nidavellia, brothers. Hey, dwarves! Oh, they're uh, running away. Um an alarm. I'd only sound an alarm like that if I still had my body and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. Why all that for us though? They are scared. It wasn't definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. Maybe it's not for us. Could we talk we to you for any trouble, please? There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own. And hope they let us in. Tavern, huh? Is that a statue of Odin? They must really love him here. Poor fear. Sindri! Hello! I'd return your surprise, but I did know you'd be here. I've got something for you. This is gonna have something to do with those green stones. What is it, dwarf? You know, I'm glad I came back here at least once before Ragnarok. Oh, if these cobblestones could talk. Then they'd have mouths. <laughs> Filthy, disgusting mouths. <laughs> do you mind if I fiddle with your bow? Might as well. Well, you are long overdue for a replacement. <sighs> Taking advantage of certain material. Ow! Structural sensitivity to sonic vibrations has been something uh, I've been meaning to try for quite some time now. Thanks for uh, finally trying it. What's it going to be this time? <sighs> Patience. <laughs> I find it's best to see these things oh, in action. Ah. Whoa. There. Oh, take aim at that gate there. But before you loose, say Ski Alpha. Ah! 
Well, I certainly didn't expect you to disturb half the creepy crawlers in need of them here. How was I supposed to know they were there? Hell yeah. Okay, so, Derlin. Right. Sindri, any idea where the tavern is? Do I look like I've ever been to a filthy tavern? The sewer you just punched a hole through seems promising, though. For you. To a tavern? It should lead to the other side of the city. Hmm. It's not like you're able to open other doors around here. Okay, are you done talking? I want to blow this up. Jump up. There we go. Take this that. lockdown really is because of us? Oh my, yes. Odin's grip on this realm is so firm, any outsider is considered a threat. Sounds like an Odinism if I ever had one. Oh, well, that sucks. Best of luck. Thanks. Any outsider is considered a threat. Is that to protect the dwarves? It sounds like it. But knowing Odin, there's sure to be an ulterior motive. Maybe he knew we'd come. Well, everyone's hiding on this side too. Odin's occupation of this realm has its hooks in deep. But there aren't any guards patrolling. We're clearly not a threat. Why hide? Resist and you're made an example of. To keep the rest in line. Self-preservation can outweigh bravery for even the strongest of folk. Fear keeps them safe and alive. Ah, oh, Jesus. <laughs> Fuck, little bitch. Right, give him what for. God damn. I slammed the shit out of that guy. Ooh. How do I get up there? Uh, probably has something to do with that that I can't get to yet. Okay. No worries. Looks to be an artifact from the Dwarven Resistance. A firebomb from the chief anti-Odin propagandist in Durland's Rebellion. We got grenades now? Which she had until she turned to less subtle means of resistance. Brock may be interested in getting these back. Better in his hands than out in the open. Yuck. Jesus. Ow. Fuck it. Kratos is being gentle. Right? Well, it's like a house. If he's here, maybe you should let me do the talking. You. Well, we don't want to intimidate him. You're tall as a tree and you have a severed head on your head. Mm. <clears throat> None taken. Fair point, though. Very well. I think that's him. Hello? Watch yourselves. Apparently, there are intruders about. Huh. Oh, that's us, I think. Eh, well, if you're planning on killing me, at least let me finish this song. That alarm was in just the perfect key. We're just looking for a friend of ours named Derlin. <laughs> well, we both know that's not true. Derlin's got no friends left. But if that's all you need, head out the back way there. And you'll see the safety office just across the river. Just don't go making trouble for the rest of us. And while you travel through this realm, maybe you could clean up the head's mess. The head? What mess? Later, brother. Huh? Okay, later. Sorry, one more thing. 
Although, these are gifts I'm giving to you, so I shouldn't be sorry and you should be thankful. Anyways, here, please be careful. What the hell is that? It's beautiful. Thanks, Sindri. It is beautiful, isn't it? It's also very useful. You'll be able to find anything your heart desires with it. Really? As long as your heart desires the locations your father and you decide and plot to travel together, mm. then yes. It is a compass. Ah, but a beautiful compass. Now scamper off. Compass and map. Press the left side of the touchpad to jump to the map. Use the left stick to move around the map. Right stick to zoom in and out. Track locations by hovering over them and pressing the triangle. Press L3 on the s to center it on us. Side panel displays. Okay. Thanks for teaching us to use the map now. Follow the gold icon, stay on the path, or track favors, um, blue icons. A boat cannot be far. Oh wow, that's the first time it showed the compass on our huh. ship. Really, your Sindri made it sound like Derlin was some sort of rebellion leader. Doesn't sound like anyone's following him. Was being the key word here, little brother. And we've got another goddamn boat. Alright. There's a building just past these rocks behind me. Maybe we should head that way. Ramir, why do the dwarves hate you? Oh, in the bay just beyond this tunnel. I helped build some mining rigs. What about them? They're a mistake of mine, from quite a long time ago. If you've got the time, I'd have us turn them off. All right. I'd particularly appreciate us checking out the mining rigs in the lake to the right. You can see the smokestacks from here. But if you don't want to explore now, it looks like Derlin's place is through that open gate to the left. Got it. It's now it's giving us the opportunity to So choose. which way do we go? We could prepare more before rescuing Tyr. Up to you. Alright. We're gonna go to Tyr right now. Or at least meet the guy. So we're going to Durlands? Makes sense. We could always explore those mining rigs later. See. Yeah. Just as I thought too. This is the safety office? Well, the sign of hair's breadth away from a head injury up there certainly gives that impression. For Darlin? You have an appointment? <laughs> yeah, you do the talking. Uh, no? Has anyone ever had an appointment here? <laughs> here to collect on something, pal. I think uh, parading a severed head around on your hip is gonna scare me into somehow approving Estrid's accretion proposal, eh? We are looking for a prisoner of Odin's. <laughs> He's being kept in a mine somewhere. Some friends of ours said that you could help. Where did you get? Hmm? You chop her head off with that too, eh? She was my wife. What the fuck? Dina and I wondered where she went after our little coup here failed. Failed? Yeah, come, come. Failed. Faye is dead. Hmm. 
Best of them all. One's left alive after pay the price. I'm afraid <clears throat> I can't help you with your little prisoner situation. But he could have answers on how to stop Odin and free Svartalfheim from the Aesir. Now, I'm not in the business of crossing the old father anymore. Wait, before you go. Fuck. Take this. What is it? A fine. Huh? Hygiene code violation for improper transport of a rotting head. Uh, two demerits for speaking the All Father's given name and, uh, yeah, yeah. For fucking up my desk! A fine? Pay it at your leisure, okay? Get out of my office. You wanted to do the talking, boy. Hey there. So what about get out of my office? Don't you understand? You said her name was Diener? Oh, uh, sure. Thank you. I think. Exit Durland's office to the port. Okay, well... Hey, this isn't a fine. Not now. There are enemies ahead. And we'll get them next time.